and then I'll. All right, folks. I'm here with Brian at Hands On Auto Training. He's up here doing some programming for a what is this? 2013 Chevy Malibu for me. We put a transmission in, and here is his setup right here. Yeah, we've got the. Uh we're using SPS2. This is through TechLine Connect, guys. This is the issues that you get with used transmissions sometimes. Watch what happens. Just pay attention. It already aired out once. We're going to see if it airs out again here, but uh, we're trying to do a used transmission. We're making sure we get the right calibrations and get the proper, uh, you know, uh, VIN number in the vehicle. And uh, watch this. Here you go. This is, the, this is where the magic happens. Not really. Uh-oh. Yeah, that's not good. So we're going to have to find our alternative means to get this job done. But we're going to make it happen. We'll get the job done right. And uh, we'll show you a clip at the end here when we do get the VIN number properly written to this vehicle. And as you see, this totally aired out. We got the 4491 and the 4423. So we're going to have to go ahead and uh, do our alternative means to get this job done properly. All right, guys, we got this done. As you see here, the transmission control module that we originally had had this VIN number in it. It didn't match the vehicle VIN, so we're going to go ahead and uh, show you that we've, we're in GDS2 right now. We got the job done right. Everything is perfect. Got the job done. Any questions? Well, you got anything else you want to show? No, check out handsonautotraining.com. Be sure to watch Thurman. Uh, man, I can't do that. We got you got to cut it off. I'm used to saying I got to say. This. Go ahead. Thanks a lot for watching. This is your transmission. Be sure to check out uh, Hands On Auto Training as well. And you guys have a great day. Oh, I don't know what to say. I'm not good on the spot. So now we're going to go back and we're going to check all the DTCs here. Diagnostic trouble codes. Go back and do a whole vehicle DTC scan. Instead of module diagnostics, we're going to go to vehicle diagnostics, vehicle DTC information. This is going to scan the entire vehicle. Every module on the car is going to get pinged, and uh, let's see what happens. Give it a second. Got to be patient with this stuff, right? And here's all the modules listed, and let's see. We've got a couple codes and a brake control module, and also this steering axis sensor module. Let's go ahead and click on details. We'll see what they are. And the good news is these are all history codes. As you see over here, everything's listed as history. So we don't have any problems. We're just going to get, go to clear all DTCs, add all DTCs, and hit OK. OK. You hear the car dinging because it's talking. Now it's rescanning an entire vehicle. And uh, as you see here, no codes. Everything got scanned out. Looking good. Time for a good old-fashioned test drive.